Hello everybody, I'm here to do a bead haul and a resin haul. I'm going to go ahead and get started because I don't have much time. So, I made three orders last month with House of Ink. And I'm going to combine them all together because I mixed them all up and I don't know which was my first order and which was my last one. So, yeah, I'm just going to go randomly, but there were three orders. And I do plan to make more. Just need to save my pennies. Anyways, I got this 16 um, molds. Cabbage on. There's 16 in them. And since I make jewelry, I figured I can make cabbage ons and bead around them. And make pendants and keychains and stuff like that. So... Then I got this tile one, <coughs> excuse me, it's way larger than I thought, and I'm not complaining, believe me. When I saw this, it took me by surprise, and I was like, yes, and I'm very happy with it because now I can make wall hangings and make all kinds of creative stuff with it. Very happy. I also got this little cupcake. I don't know if you can really see it or not. For resin, this razor for resin. Hello Kitty bow for resin. Some big fat puppy lips for resin. Some fish bones, um, yeah, for resin. I also got this little Mogi Mogi Party notebook, and this is gonna be great for when I send out packages. I can write little notes on them and whatnot. Got me some clay cane, clay canes, five for a dollar. She sends them randomly. <coughs> Excuse me. And got me 15 of them. Can't wait to use those. Sticky notepad. Ice cream. Cute. Some cabbage ons. I got some Barbie heads. <coughs> Excuse me, right there. With a little playing card. Actually, there's an, there should be another one somewhere around here. There's two of them. Got those. Chanel. Got two of those. Louis Vuitton. Got two blacks and two pinks. Got some chocolates. Well, half bitten chocolates. Got two Minnie Mouse donuts with sprinkles and a little bow in the corner and oh yeah there's another playing card then I got some stickers from her Mama Goma very cute I like the little milk one it's so cute Got the Rillacuma. Little chocolate bear with his buddy right there hanging out. <coughs> and it came with two sheets. Isn't that cute? Got little Miss... Miss Hello Kitty. Sorry about the glare. Well, anyway, she has a metallic finish on them and they're kind of puffy. And there's Hello Kitty and Jam and Cupcakes and Clovers and Cherries and Carrots and Ladybugs and all kinds of cute stuff there. Two sheets of sweets. Candies and lollipops and biscuits and cookies and cakes and whatnot. Yeah. And I like the fact that she sent them in this 
She made a pocket out of the manila folder. I thought that was so clever. I'm going to have to steal this idea when I ship out stickers and stuff like that. So, yeah. And from e Oh, before I forget. I also ordered from her this um, four cabochons swirly lollipops. And she also sent me this free gift. <coughs> it's a Hello Kitty pin. Okay, now from eBay, I sent for these glue sticks. They're brown, and I'm going to use them to make chocolate sauce. I know it sounds weird, but I saw a lot of people using them on YouTube, and I, it looks really realistic. It looks like chocolate sauce. makes you want to eat it, but you can't. And, oh. I skipped ahead. From House of Ink Houston, I got the paper tape, Chocopa, the chocolate bear with the panda and sweets and candy bars, and Willakuma. They're cute. And the bunny outfit. I got those two. Okay, now moving on. <coughs> I ordered a couple of things from Cats Perfect, and one of them is this. Day of the Dead Skull, Dia de los Muertos, or some people call them Sugar Skulls. I love the fact that it has so much detail and you can experiment with a lot of colors in them. Can't wait to work with that. And I got the corset. How cute is that? Again, can't wait to work with these. I'm getting everything together and everything because in May, that's when I'm going to start working with resin. That's when the weather is warmer and it's easier and safer for me to work with it because you have to be in a ventilated area. So, yeah, that's... So in the meantime, I'm just getting all the molds and everything I can together so I can start working with it. Alrighty, from Joanne's, I got beads and findings. The beads were 50% off and the findings were 25% off. And I got some gold toggles, hummingbirds, I hope you can see that, for some reason there's one of focus, but yeah I got those, some silver ones, They're pretty, I love those, <clears throat> then I got some beads, some big fat chunky beads, I make these kind of beads with clay and I embed the right stones in them but I got these because they have a certain pattern that I would like to get inspired from if not I probably copy a couple I don't know <laughs> but I prefer to just you know get inspired and make my own designs but yeah then I bought these it's like a Victorian looking it has a little flower right there Got the crystal and the pearl. Very pretty. Got these two dark red. I like the fact how the embedded micro marbles in here. Hmm. Now my wheels are turning. Then I got me some spacers. They're silver. They came with little black beads in between. Yep. Again, these were 50% off. And the findings were, the toggles were 25% off. But then that was a few weeks ago. So maybe they're, they're on sale again or maybe they're not. I don't know. Anyways, from my local bead star, I got me a tube of spiral bugle beads for $4.99. They're 6 millimeter and... I'm going to try to put it closer. Hmm. Well, anyways, yeah. They're 6 millimeter, and I think it's worth it. Four ninety nine. you get a big old tube of beads. Got me a bunch of 3 millimeter. Got it in amber with metallic. Red with metallic. 
purple with metallic. I got it in this like an off white, got two strands, like a cream color with metallic. It looks white, but it's not, it's really like a cream color. Black with metallic. Pink with metallic. Gray with metallic. And this orangey with white crystal. And, yep, metallic. <coughs> so, yeah, and then from Walmart. I went there the other day. And I got me a, a thing of Omniflex monofilament fishing line. I got it in a 12 pound. I usually work with 8 or 10 but they didn't have any so I got the 12 pound and I figured I'm going to go ahead and experiment with it and see how it works. Got me some more duct tape and zebra. Oh, one thing of cupcake stickers. I have a whole bunch of these but I can't get enough of them. Can't have too many cupcakes. Just can't. Tried. And a little packet of a, a dollar baggie of orange round beef. And I guess that's going to do it for now. So, yeah. Comment and subscribe and you guys have a good day. Bye.